Hi guys, so this is Adrian, your uh, coding instructor. Uh, today I'm back with um, this uh, sensor, this uh, VR sensor in VEX Robotics coding uh, that basically um, tells the ro robot where it is. Uh, and everything is based on X, Y uh, coordinates. Uh, remember the system of coordinates in uh, VEX VR is basically a system of coordinates with the origin in the middle of the big square okay uh so you have a big square which is basically every single playground that you have and the origin or the point of coordinate zero and zero is always in the middle okay up here you're around the 900 and here you're also around 900 and of course on the y-axis here you're going to be around negative 900 and on the x-axis you're going to be here or around negative 800 okay so this is how you position yourself on the grid so that's how you know how to drive okay other than that the or or better said that's how you know where to drive um so with that being said let's uh, run the code let's see what it does and this is on the castle crasher uh where basically my objective is to crash all the cubes of the castle so first i'm gonna crash this one i'm gonna go up and i'm gonna drive all the way up there make it right uh i'm gonna crash this one here and then i'm gonna come down and as i drive folks please observe here under sensors on the upper right side of the screen that i'm keeping track of the of my position coordinates in x and y and millimeters this is a really good way of keeping track of that of course you also have it up here uh but this is better because uh, that that's how you track uh, the content and value of some of your variables okay so with this i uh, crashed all the components of this uh, castles and now i will explain the code a little bit so the code is fairly straightforward um as soon as I start, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna drive forward, and obviously I'm facing up when I start, uh, and I'm down there at the bottom. So I will go. I will wait. I will drive forward and wait until position Y in millimeters is greater than seven hundred. Here I have to put greater than seven hundred and not equal seven hundred. It will not work with equal. I mean, try it out, but you will see that it will keep driving and it will crash. Uh, so once this particular position on the y-axis became larger than 700, I'm going to turn right and I'm going to drive four, which in this case, it means driving to the right. And then it pretty much follows the same patterns, except, um, now I'm on the x-axis greater than 700, turn right, drive forward, wait until, uh, as I'm heading down on the square um uh, uh remember the coordinates um i'm gonna move into the negatives uh here don't make the mistake to put uh, greater than negative 700 because it will not drive enough here you want to use less than negative 700 which is going to be down below uh and the same thing for x-axis i'm gonna turn uh finally on the left uh, uh uh, downstairs corner i'm gonna uh, turn right for 90 degrees head up and um, uh, here i drove a little more uh, about 800 positive uh, to make it to the uh, middle of that block just that's just how the castles are the blocks of the castles are configured uh, but this is essentially what it is uh, it's very straightforward and i will see you next time thank you for watching